morning children today we shall learn about linear equation but first let us revise what an algebraic equation is you already know x plus 14 equal to 20 is an algebraic equation so an equation is a mathematical statement which equates two quantities it shows the equality between two quantities in this equation the expression on the left side of the equality sign is the left hand side that is lhs in short and the expression on the right side of the equality sign is the right hand side rhs in short in an equation the values of expressions on the lhs and the rhs are equal what does it mean this means x plus 14 its value is equal to 20 you know the equality happens to be true only for certain values of variable these values are solutions of the equation for example let us put x equal to 6 in the equation x plus 14 equal to 20 So on the LHS we get six plus fourteen. Six plus fourteen on addition gives twenty. Twenty is equal to twenty. So what can you say? We can say LHS equal to RHS, which is equal to twenty. Hence, we can say x equal to six is the solution of this equation. Now let us see different algebraic expressions. Three fifty x plus twenty, seven y square plus y, six x minus nine, three x cube plus two, seven plus four y. So here we see different algebraic expressions. Can you tell? which expressions have highest power of variable greater than 1 if you see in expression 7y square plus y y is the variable and the highest power of variable y is 2 next coming to expression 3x cube plus 2 here the variable is x and the highest power of x is 3 Which expressions have variables with highest power of variable equal to one? If we see in the expression six x minus nine, the highest power of the variable x is one. Next, in the expression three fifty x plus twenty, again the highest power of the variable is one. Similarly, in seven plus four y also. power of variable y is 1 you know such expressions with highest power of variable equal to 1 are called linear expressions so all this three expressions are linear expressions because the highest power of variable in each case is equal to 1 and the equation with linear expressions in one variable only are called linear equation in one variable so if you see in the first equation x plus 7 equal to 30 there is one variable which is x and its highest power or you can say just the power is 1 only also in the second equation 7 plus 4y equal to 19 here the variable is y and its power is 1 so these are the examples of linear equation with single variable now let's try to solve a linear equation 9 plus 2y is equal to 6 we should solve it to get the value of y here we need to find the value of y so the first step should be transpose 9 which is on the left side to 
right hand side why because we want only the variable to be on the left hand side on moving 9 to rhs it becomes minus 9 so we get the equation as 2y equal to 6 minus 9 6 minus 9 is equal to minus 3 as we are doing here integer subtraction so we subtract 9 from 6 we get 3 and then we put the sign of the integer which has higher absolute value so minus 9 has a higher absolute value which is 9 so 6 minus 9 is equal to minus 3 thus equation reduces to 2y equal to minus 3 now as we want to get the value of variable y let's divide both the LHS and RHS by 2 on the LHS 2y divided by 2 becomes y as 2 in the numerator and in denominator cancel each other and on the RHS minus 3 divided by 2 gives minus 3 by 2 thus the solution of the given linear equation is y equal to minus 3 by 2 now how to check whether the answer we got y equal to minus 3 by 2 is correct or not let us see we have the equation 9 plus 2y equal to 6 let's put the value of y equal to minus 3 by 2 in the given equation and if the LHS comes out to be equal to RHS then we can say minus 3 by 2 is the solution of the given equation so let us put value of y equal to minus 3 by 2 in the equation on the LHS 9 plus 2 instead of y we write minus 3 by 2 as it is 2y it becomes 2 multiplied by minus 3 by 2 on the LHS solving the LHS further 2 in the numerator and 2 in the denominator gets cancelled on the LHS and we get 9 minus 3 on the LHS 9 minus 3 is equal to 6 so what do we say 6 equal to 6 which means LHS equal to RHS hence we can say y equal to minus 3 by 2 is the solution of this linear equation so now you know what is a linear equation in one variable and how to solve it and also how to check whether the solution you got is right or not that's all for now bye bye children